happens when you live in that space of integrity, authenticity, responsibility, and enriching. I would like to show a very powerful poem manifestation where just by visualizing through the third eye and projecting it on a granite slab, another person will be able to see what it is. So this is the Shakti that has been there since the time of Meenakshi. So before directly entering into the Shakti, I would actually like to sh chant the Shastra Pramana, the scriptural reference to the Shakti. From the Vijnana Bhairava Tantra, Sutra 84, Dharana 61. Akasham vimalam pashyan, kritva drishtim nirantaram, stabdhatma takshana devi, bhairavam vapurapnuyat. The translation goes, Looking at the spotless, infinite etheric space, Akasha, beyond the sky and clouds, one should fix one's gaze from the third eye without blinking, continuously and make the body and inner space steady and motionless. In that very moment, O Devi, one attains the nature and powers of the infinite space, Bhairava. So we just saw beautifully how Paramashiva says, just by being in that space of oneness, the power manifestation happens. So today along with this, we have one of the most powerful power manifestors, Manitya Virajananda. A balisant of the Nityananda Gurukul. So she is going to be expressing the Shakti where basically I'll be opening this random image generator and that will be generating a random image. And she will see in the Krishna what that image is. And she will be able to describe the image exactly. So I would like to show you what the Krishna is. So this is the Krishna a granite slab on which the Jnanandra, which is the knowledge eyeliner, is applied on this. So she will be chanting the Mahavakya three times and then she'll be seeing the image on this and describing it. So now I'll show all of you the image that has been projected by the random image generator. So here I have the random image generator. Now I'm going to be clicking it so that I get a random image. So now this image will be seen by Manitya Virajananda on this Krishna Yes, so you can go ahead. Om Nityananda Paramashivoham Om Nityananda Paramashivoham Om Nityananda Paramashivoham Yes, you can go ahead and share what you could see. Okay. So, what the Krishna Shira revealed to me is that um, I'm able to see water, and plus behind behind it is like some tall buildings you can see, and front is like you can see it's like a 
uh, it's a view like uh, there's few chairs like a table chairs and something like that wooden and behind us there's a sea and then few buildings on it yes okay there was like precise to the dot actually if you see she did it like within a few seconds this shakti actually is an expression of a very powerful space of oneness with swamiji because imagine this an image appearing on a simple granite slab right this happens only when you chant the mahavakya and when you get into that space of oneness with swamiji so once again i'm showing all of you that what she is described is exactly what the image was So, I would like all of you to understand just this one thing: experiencing this space of oneness doesn't need any effort from your side. All you need to do is to come and join us in any one of our kailasas and remain in this space of oneness with Swamiji. So, thank you, Mavarja, for joining us today, and thank you all for witnessing this power manifestation. With this, we offer our gratitude at the feet of Paramashiva and Parashakti. in the form of his divine holiness bhagwan shri nityananda parameshwar thank you nityananda The next offering is the offering of the Sangeeta Seva at the feet of Devi Nityanandeshwari Parashakti Sameta Shri Nityanandeshwara Paramashiva. Deva Deva Uttama Deva Ta Sarva Bhoma Akhilanda Koti Brahmanda Nayaka Shri Nityanandeshwari Parashakti Sameta Shri Nityanandeshwara Paramashiva Sangeeta Priya Sangeeta Mavadharaya
The next offering of today's Uttamottama Seva is the offering of the Nritya Seva. Deva Deva Uttama Devata Sarabhoma Akilanda Koti Brahmanda Nayaka Shinanande Eshwari Parashakti Sameta Shinityanande Eshwari Paramashiva Nritya Priya Nritya Mavadaraya
As usual, it was an early morning when the young Rajeshekaran left the house to go to the temple. In the temple, he sees his gurus, Isakki Swamigal, Mata Vibhudananda Puri, and Yogananda Puri. They give him a plate, a few herbs to eat, which will help him in understanding the subtle topics. Rajashekaran then puts up a question. There are many people who study the Vedas and Upanishads. Don't they follow the herbal diet? In response, Mata Vibhudananda Puri gives a smile and looks at Isakki Swamigal when he responds by chanting a small verse. Ahara Shuddho Sattva Shuddhihi Sattva Shuddho Dhruva Smritihi Yet, Raja Shekaran is still not able to grasp the answer and so asks the same question again. And so, Isakke Swamigal explains that whether they understand or not, whether they grasp or grab, finally, the result and responsibility goes just with them. Whether they understand or misunderstand, it gets destroyed along with them. But in your case, we cannot take the risk because whatever you are going to say, the world is going to listen to you. So you have to understand properly. But still, Rajeshekaran could not understand why he should take a herbal diet that contains neem, tulasi, bilva juice and dhruva grass juice. And so he asks yet once again. Then his gurus tell him, all right, Go eat whatever you want today and come back tomorrow. And so, Rajashekran goes home and eats vadas, which is a South Indian traditional fried snack with payasam, the semi-liquid sweet. As he rests for the day, the next day, he goes once again to his gurus. But that day, he could not understand anything that they tried to teach him. Rajeshekan then realized why he has to take a herbal diet and tells his gurus, Isakki Swamigal then gives Rajeshekaran some haritaki, beetle leaves and sesame oil and makes him eat it to clean his stomach. And only after three days, it took three days for Rajeshekaran's body to get completely cleansed. And only after the three days had passed by of intaking the herbal supplements, Rajeshekaran started grasping and learning what his gurus were teaching him. The next offering is the offering of the Tirukkailaya Vadyam 
at the feet of Devi Nityanandeshwari Parashakti Sameta, Sri Nityanandeshwara Paramashiva. देवदे वोतम देवता सार्व भूम अखिलांड गोटि ब्रह्मांड नायक श्री नित्यानुंदेश्वरी बराशक्ति समेत श्री नित्यानुंदेश्वर बरमशिवा चतुर्वेद प्रिय चतुर्वेदम अवधारया हरि ओम अग्निमीले पुरोहित दैन अग्न्यस्य देवम रत्विजम होता आरम रत्नधाता मम हरि ओम हरि ओम इशेत वोजेत्वा वाग्यवस्तो पाग्यवस्त देवो हरि ओम हरि ओम अग्न आया ही वीतये ग्रनानो हव्यदातये निहोता सत्सि वरिषि हरि ओम हरि ओम शन्नो देवी रविष्टय आपो बंद वीतये शन्यो रविश्रवंतुना हरि ओम देवदेवोत्तम देवतास्सारु भूम अखिलांड गोटि ब्रह्मांडनाय कश्चिनित्यानंदेश्वरी बराशक्ति समेत श्रीनित्यानंदेश्वर बरमिशिवा आगमश्लोक प्रियागमश्लोक मवदारया तया पूर्या सुमोर्धान्तम् भंक्त्वा भ्रुक्षे पसे दुना निर्विकल्पम् मनक्रित्वा सर्वोद्वे सर्वगुर्गमा हा देवदे वोत्तम देवता सार्वभोम अखिलांड गोटि ब्रह्मांड नायक श्रीनित्यानंदेश्वरी पराशक्ति समेत श्रीनित्यानंदेश्वर बरमशिवस्तोत्र प्रियस्त Sarvatantraswarupaya, Sarvatatvavidhuraya, Brunharudravatarine, Nilakanthaya, Parvatimanoharaya, Somasuryagnilochanaya, Bhasmodhulitavigrahaya, Mahamanimukudharanaya, Manikyabhushanaya, Shrishtistitipralayakalaraudravataraya, Dakshadvaradhvamsakaya, Mahakalabhedanaya, Mooladharekanilayaya, Tattvatitaya, Gangadharaya, Sarvadevadhidevaya, Shadashrayaya, Vedantasaraya, Trivargasadhanaya, Anandakoti Brahmandanayakaya, Vasukidakshakakar Kotaka Shankakulika Padma Mahapadmeti, Ashtamahana Gulabhushanaya, Pranavasvarupaya, Chidakashaya, Akashadikswarupaya, Ghranakshatramaline, Sakalaya, Kalankarahitaya, Sakalaloke Kahartre, Sakalaloke Kahartre, Sakalaloke Kasamhartre, Sakalaloke Kagurave, Sakalaloke Kasakshine, Sakalanikabaguhyaya, Sakalavedanta Paragaya, Sakalaloke Kavarapradaya, Sakalaloke Kashankaraya, Shashanka Shekharaya, Shashwan Nirabhasaya, Nirabhasaya, Niramayaya, Nirmalaya, Nirlobhaya, Nirmadaya, Nishchintaya, Nirahankaraya, Nirangushaya, Nishkalankaya, Nirgunaya, Nishkamaya, Nirupadravaya, Niravadhyaya, Nirantaraya, Nishkaranaya, Nirantakaya, Nishprapanchaya, Nishangaya, Nirdvandvaya, Niradharaya, Niragaya, Nishkrodhaya, Nirmalaya, Nishpapaya, Nirmayaya, Nirbhayaya, Nirvikalpaya, Nirbhedaya, Nishkriyaya, Nishtulaya, Nishamshayaya, Niranjanaya, Nirupamavibhavaya, Nityashuddha Buddha, Purna Satchidanandadvayaya, Paramashantaswa,